what's going on, what they did to you. You getting your justice, you coming into union. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Angels, Ancestors, and the ones that passed away. What does the collective need to know? What do they need to be aware of? Somebody could have, um, could be, you know, have a uh, prosthetic leg. Because when I just looked at this guy right here, I, I thought that he had one leg. Somebody could have, maybe they're in the military or something, they could have lost or had diabetes or something. Somebody could have one leg. When I just looked at it for some reason, I, I thought that he had only one leg for some reason. So maybe somebody has a prosthetic leg. This could be you or somebody involved in the situation. Somebody could have lost a leg, maybe an accident, a bike accident, or this might end up happening. Death. They were trying to plan your death, these people from your past. They're under the last judgment. Yeah, it was, oh shit. Some of your karmic family that you walked away from, they're planning your death so that they could steal whatever this is that they're holding on to. But God stepped in. They did this death magic. And God said, absolutely not. You know what? You want to keep playing. How about I'm going to send the devil in to collect your soul. And it's somebody from your fucking past that worked with your family, your karmic family that you walked away from. The truth has come out about that. And you're going to find out. Somebody tried to sacrifice you one million percent. Someone tried to sacrifice you. Somebody from your past. This is our last judgment. Like, God's throwing his hands up. He's had enough of this shit. He said, no, I don't think so, bro. You want, you going to keep fucking with my collective? Say no more. Go ahead, devil. Go collect. And he, that's what he's doing. Or he did one or the other. Somebody could have a nose ring. This could be you or somebody involved in the situation. There's some about a, a motorcycle accident or a bike accident. I don't know if this happened already or if it's going to happen. All your hard work is paying off. Oh, shit. We have 8-8. Eight, eight. Look, the 8 of Pentacles. Followed by the 8 of Swords. These idiots are getting locked up. 88. They're getting locked up. That's like the handcuffs. And also the 8 of Swords is, is getting locked up. But you're, you're getting abundance and prosperity, okay? You're, all your hard work, what you're doing for work is paying off tremendously. You're planning your whole new world, all right? And it's exposing these scumbags for some reason, whatever they did to you. And, um... They're getting locked up. You got someone coming in to protect you to lock, you know, lock these people up. Somebody was trying to frame you. They're working hard to try to get you locked up and frame you. That's not happening. Or your divine counterpart, one or the other. Somebody's doing some sort of binding magic on either you or your divine counterpart. It's not working. Idiots. Somebody was trying to get you tied up and the kidnapped, tied up and bound in some weird shit, but you were too protected from this. So again, let's not forget to give God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, and the ones who passed away the utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation for all that they do. Um, you might find out that you're somebody's fucking married. That you like you like somebody. They might have been planning to either marry you and like unalive you to steal whatever they're stealing from you. Or you might find out someone got married under your name. They could have sold your identity. Let's just, you know, leave it in the comments, yo. I'm going to make it very abundantly clear again. I have never been married before. So if anybody is married under the name of Misty M, you're a lying ass fool. I ain't never been married. So don't play with me. You stupid little bitch. <laughs> Yes, you might find that out. I'm strongly getting that for somebody. You could have stole your identity and got married under your name to try to steal whatever this is they stole from you. Or attempted to steal. They're going to jail for the cops know about it. Or there's like a fake marriage or something. Bitch, I have never been married. I have not, never yet. And I don't even have a boyfriend, let alone a fucking husband. What the fuck? I am single, celibate, and, and just waiting. <laughs> okay? I don't even talk to nobody. So whoever the fuck, what the fuck? You're moving away. And these people are in deep emotional pain because you're, you're coming out of, like, rough waters into smooth sailing. The six of swords to the three of swords. And you're protected. You, and there's a, some sort of protection order here. The justice, 
Yeah, they're, they're the feds are watching somebody. You got like the, the police are watching and protecting you. And whatever you're investing in, because they, they know what they're investing. They're investing to get you locked up. They're trying to get you bound up, tied up, and, you know, unalived. Your dumbass ex. Working with your karmic ass family. Oh, that's cute. This four of swords just went over top of the queen of cups while she's in her wedding dress. If you've been praying to get married, to like one day get married, um, it's happening, okay? Or like maybe your divine counterpart is praying to, to marry you. <laughs> There's something about someone praying for a marriage. That's cute. Something about a cemetery. You might, someone passed away. I'm telling you right now, you're going to find out someone passed away if they're about to. The mountains could be significant. Thank you, Spirit. Okay. We got, oh shit. The Ace of Pentacles, I mean, the Ace of Swords in the reverse. Somebody was made major lies. God stepped in and all these major lies and betrayals that were done about you. Okay, there was to, and it was to get you locked up. They made somebody went to the justice system and made like slandered your name and like tried saying that like major major lies and um, lack of truth and clarity. Okay, King of Pentacles in the reverse. It was so that this you know scumbag, this cold hearted, the like, cutthroat, um, do anything for money besides work for it. Like robbing ass, lusty little piece of crap. You know. They get their money underhandedly. This is what their plans were. To smile on your face, stab you in the back there this whole time. They were trying to plot and plan your demise. They went to the justice system and lied on you. The cops know, I mean, yeah, the cops know about this too, but like God stepped in. It's in God's hands, okay? You're manifesting the truth and clarity coming out, okay? They're heavily burdened about all the lies of betrayals and, um, there's a hidden, there's a hidden, um, imprisonment. Someone's in prison, maybe, maybe it's your ex or something. We have the King of Cups right here. Oh, look, the Queen of Cups and the King of Cups is right over top of the King. I didn't even realize that I was right here. I didn't even realize that I was right there. The King and Queen, you're manifesting this. There's some sort of, and I'm telling you right now, there's a hidden marriage. Someone's going to find out they're fucking married. Again, um, I've never been married. Don't fucking play with me. I'm strongly getting someone's finding out there's a major lies and betrayals saying that you were married. Someone got married in your fucking name. I'm strongly getting that. God stepped in on that, though. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Again, I, Misty, M-I-S-T-Y-E-M-S, -E just like the ambulance. Yes, I've never been married yet. <laughs> so y'all can suck a dick if anybody tried marrying anybody under my name. You got me fucked up. There's some sort of hidden marriage, though, for sure. Somebody got married under your fucking name. Or attempted to. We have the Empress followed by the Devil. The Devil's coming to collect someone's soul right now. I'm telling you right now. So maybe somebody in jail. You're very creative. You're very fertile in whatever you're doing for work. You're planning your whole new world. Your creativity, your fertility, whatever you're doing for work, okay? Um, and they're like, one's you, one's your divine counterpart, okay? Um... They work super hard in this devilish energy to get you locked up with major lies and betrayals. Okay, lots of lack of truth and clarity. Okay, there's some major, major lies. And I'm telling you right now, someone's going to find out they're married. Somebody got married. They stole your identity and got married under your name. I'll fuck somebody up. I don't give a fuck. That's... Hello? I don't know who you I don't know who you are. I don't answer numbers I don't know. God, you heard your prayers. They're being answered now. They, someone's praying that you, you forgive them. They want to apologize to you because they're about to get some sort of um, some sort of message of truth and clarity about this. Someone's doing black magic on you. They're doing death magic. They're doing all types of shit. You're, the devil's protecting you as well. Like I said, and like God stepped in, it's in God's hands. God's letting the devil come in, maybe possibly your ex. 
could be extra heavily burdened. They're wearing they're they're heavily burdened. They're wearing a mask. They're acting like they're not upset about. It. They're just not scared. They're they're terrified. They're absolutely terrified. Don't let them fucking fool you. What's the outcome, please? And thank you. They're spying on you. We got the Page of Swords and the Five of Wands. Your divine counterparts watching you, they were told a lot of lack of truth and clarity. Like they were lied to about you. They're watching you. They see that these people were lying. Okay. They know the truth now. God stepped in when it came to this whole situation, all right? They're watching you. They like what you you know, what you're what they what they, what they see, okay? Now these people in established energy are fighting amongst each other about, you know, um, maybe it seems your divine counterpart might be wanting to whoop somebody's ass. I don't fucking know. But um they're also the devil's watching them. Someone's I'm telling you right now, it's the devil's sucking someone's soul. If they didn't already, if he didn't already, but also the authorities, so the cops are watching these people. So they, the God stepped in when you know God has his earth angels made sure that like the truth and clarity about everything came out about when all these major lies and betrayals that were done to you. Somebody's fucking married. I'm telling you, Rian. Someone's gonna find out that. Whatever seed you're planting, they're fighting about whatever seed you're planting. Your investments are like flourishing, okay? Whatever seed you're planting, are, um, they're spying on whatever it is that you got going on, whatever you're investing in. And they're, they're watching it, whatever. They're fucking losers. Also, these idiots were being watched, whatever they were investing in to, to try to get you locked up and everything else. And about this hidden marriage or this false marriage, some sort of manipulative marriage. Um... You're getting justice, okay? The feds are watching or somebody's watching your ex for sure and these other people. You're protected and this is a protection order right here. The authorities are watching you. We have to determine it to the justice to the seven of wands. Um, you're protected. You, there's a protection order here. The, the police are watching them. They're also watching you. They're protecting you because they know what their plans were to get you locked up to on a live view and everything else. And these people are in deep emotional pain about you moving away. You getting this good luck and fortune and about your strength and power. They're very nervous about your strength and power and about you having your sword up against them because they're caught. They tried to sacrifice. They're caught. They're, they're in having ma um, major chaos, destruction of people on mayhem. All right. Three of Pentacles and anybody that worked together with these idiots are going through chaos, destruction of people, mayhem. They're, they're being very fucking foolish, coming for you while you're in your purpose. There are wolf and sheep clues, all right, but you're in your purpose and like they're idiots. They're dumb for trying to come at you when you're doing it. Something about a house, a foundation or a house. You're very powerful though. You 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 get to, you know you're very good looking too. You get attention over you. Go. You're going to have a reason to celebrate. You're going to get some sort of quick communication about you being the star that you truly are and everything being balanced out um, between you and your divine counterpart. You're coming into union. You're single, self-sufficient, and independent, but you're not going to be single much longer because you're coming into union. And it got your ex and everybody else all, you know, up all night, boo-hoo, crying about this painful permanent ending and you coming into union with your divine counterpart and then being over there sucking cock somewhere on the corner. Let's suck on the dick, bitch. Um, yeah, and they're getting some sort of physical, mental, emotional, or spiritual, or all the above ass open because they got the message that you're the one with the power, not them. That you're way more powerful than the screw cold coven secret society, and they screw cold coven secret society are going to fucking prison. Yeah, there, someone got kicked out of the screw cold coven secret society. Maybe the death. Maybe they. If somebody. There's, I'm telling you right now. Somebody from the from your past. They pet. Um. They're, they're passing away if they didn't already. It's from backfire. The devil's coming to collect their soul. But you're getting upgrades. You're getting some sort of spiritual upgrades. With the higher frame and to the, uh, to the chariot. And somebody is getting kicked out. And somebody's passing away. I'm telling you right now. Someone's passing away. Someone from your past. Because it's the last judgment. God stepped in. It's in God's hands. He sent the devil to come collect. It could be either someone in your past. Or it may be a karmic family. Or somebody you consider to be family. That you walked away from. But I'm only right there, guys. Um, till next time, remember God loves you, so do I spread love, not hate always. And please do not forget to give God, Jesus, angels, ancestors, on this passed away the utmost love, respect, gratitude, and appreciation because we're moving mountains, worse and getting ready to rain down miracles on us. All right. Um, all right. So, yeah, I don't know. Oh, guys, if you did not hit the like button, what are you doing? <laughs> please hit that like button, please. <laughs>
um if you like to share it you can share it and please make sure you are subscribed and you have that notification bell on to you all so you can always be updated whenever i put another message out there for you guys and don't forget you want to be subscribed if you want any parts of these giveaways i'm gonna just, um next week i'm gonna be talking about the first giveaway i'm doing but you gotta be subscribers for subscribers only all right so um i'll be doing that to make sure you're subscribed and you have your notification bell on to all so you don't miss out when I give away, when I do the giveaways, okay? Alright, guys. Um, I absolutely love you guys. I would, if you like to donate, you do not have to. You don't, um, it's not a requirement, but it is truly appreciated. The information is in the description box down below. And thank you from the bottom of But with all my heart, ahead of time to anybody and everybody who chooses to do so. To everybody who has been. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And may God bless your beautiful souls tenfold. Alright, guys. God bless. Have a beautiful and blessed day.